you need to make sure you let them know that's not what's driving you, okay? Yeah. Oh, okay. Hey, man, thanks for the call. And you are doing good stuff, man. Doing great stuff. All right, in the lobby of Ramsey Solutions, the headquarters right here, CJ and Lauren are with us. Hey, guys, how are Hi, you? Hi, we're, we're great. great. It's well, an honor so to be here. Excited. Well, it's an honor to have you guys. Where, do you, where are you from? Auburn. Auburn, Al- Alabama. Cool. So are you Auburn fans? I have two degrees from Auburn, and he went to Alabama. I have one from Alabama. So is this a house divided? Yes. <laughs> but we live in Auburn, and we owed Auburn more money, so I always say Auburn won in our household because <laughs> we owed them way more money. <laughs> so I just got an email 10 minutes ago that the Auburn Athletic Department has decided to teach our uh, college curriculum to all the athletes at Auburn. And I've heard uh, that. They yeah. just signed it up just this week. Awesome. So very, very cool. cool. Well, congratulations, you guys. You're Thank here to you. tell us your debt free story. How much have you paid off? $115,000. Whoa! And how long did that take? 34 months. Good job. Making what kind of money? Uh, when we first started, it was 63000 then 86000 and now 106000 Way to go. What do you guys do? I teach second grade. Mm-hmm. And, and I'm a director at a hospital. Very good. So, how old are you two? I just turned 30 October the 1st, mm-hmm. and he'll be 30 in April. Way to go, and you're debt-free. Yes. So what was this, student loans and what else? $10,000 on a car, and then 105000 in student loans. Okay, so what happened 34 months ago that got this whole thing started? We got married three years ago today. Uh-huh. Today is our three-year uh-huh. wedding anniversary. Oh, happy anniversary. Thank you, and um, you know, the next day reality sets in, and you are you know have this awesome wedding, and then... You sit down with the numbers, and so our debt-free freedom journey began the day after we got married. Yeah, so you, after the marriage, you sit down, look at the numbers, and you have an oh crap moment. Yep. <laughs> oh no! Yeah. What are we gonna do? Sally Mae doesn't care about our wedding. No, yeah, the they bills didn't. kept coming. Yeah, yeah, the bills kept coming. So she, we had to get real with the numbers, and so we did. Very cool. So how did you, that? How did that? What did you do? What was your first step? What? What you? How did you get this going? Well, we got on the same page, got on budget, and. Uh, First and foremost, ask God to help. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. We still continue to tithe and trust him, and he, he did it all. Very cool. And we um, had calculated that it would take us a lot longer. Yeah, you know, when we first ran the numbers, it was going to take us 66 months, mm-hmm. and then God did it in 34 months. Mm-hmm. He did. Oh, boom. Months. Like cut it in half. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so you guys got intense, obviously. And uh, so uh, how did you get plugged into us? I had taken the class in 2009. I was still in graduate school. And um, we got engaged shortly thereafter, and so the wedding came, and we paid deposits and things like that. And so the program got put to the side. And then um, I don't, just following your show and Instagram, watching the people do their screams were so inspirational, and it just kept us going through our journey. And, and so when we got married, um, he knew about you and had listened to your show um, on the way to and from work. And mm-hmm. we decided to plug in and, um, and do the program. And now we lead an FPU course in our home oh. um, through our church. So wow. we're well, leaders. So I'm sure they're all tuning in. Yeah. Hey, small group. Hey, small group. <laughs> Very cool. Good for you guys. Very fun. Chris? Hey, do you guys have any words of encouragement for those who maybe during you know, 34 months, I know there was probably some seasons where you were struggling, discouraged, frustrated, like whatever. I'm just going to go back and go back to the old way of life. What did, how did you get through all that? I don't know. Just stay disciplined and keep yeah. asking God for it, and then he'll make things happen. And you see the results happening, and um, just stay disciplined. We adopted a verse as well, a Bible verse that we clung to and we framed it and had it in, in sight so that we could keep relying on that and relying on God's word. And um, he did it. Uh-huh. What was the verse? Um, it was in Isaiah. We were going to get you to sign it. Um, but just talking about um, building um, streams through the desert, through the wilderness. He is the stream through the wasteland. And we, we believed that and clung to that. And he was our stream through our desert of financial you know, turmoil. So That is so neat. There is this mystical thing that happens between your hard work and his blessings. Yeah. And that both of them have to be present in order for these successes to occur uh, and to occur at this kind of speed. I mean, you didn't sit there and do nothing and he just shipped you money. Uh, You've been working your butts off and sacrificing and he's blessed it. It's Mm -hmm. both things going on. So congratulations, you guys. Yeah, congrats. Very, very well done. So you tell people the key you were saying, CJ, is the budget, right? Yeah, you know, stick with the budget. Um, You make more money, that means more money you throw at debt. The budget doesn't change. And then uh, we just stayed disciplined, stayed with it. Yeah, because your incomes went up like 40% during this time. That's his income, yes. And yeah. um, God kept blessing, but really also just having to learn to say no. I mean, we're young and we have a lot of friends that want to do a lot of things and take a lot of trips and go out to eat. I think our big thing was going out to eat was 
killing our budget. And so we just had to say no a lot. And we got weird. We mm -hmm. were weird. And our friends started kind of embracing our weirdness after a little bit. And Well, and now you're 30 us. years old and you paid off $115,000. That makes you officially weird. Yes. <laughs> you are yes. not we normal are at all. Yes. You're anything but normal. Normal's broke out of control and fighting about money every yeah. week. That's right. Well, congratulations, Thank you, you two. Thank very, you. Very, very, very well done. All right, CJ and Lauren, Auburn, Alabama, house divided when it comes to football, but not when it comes to knocking out the debt. $115,000 paid off in 34 months, making 63 up to 106. Count it down. Let's hear a debt-free scream. Three, two, one. We're debt-free! <laughs> Love it, love it, love it. Very well done. Oh, man, that's fabulous. Absolutely awesome.